Genome Analysis Toolkit, GATK. The Genome Analysis Toolkit, GATK, is a set of software tools developed by the Broad Institute for analyzing high-throughput sequencing data. It is widely used in the field of genomics for various applications, including variant calling, genotyping, and identifying structural variants. One of the key strengths of GATK is its ability to handle large amounts of data. As the cost of sequencing continues to decrease, more and more sequencing data is being generated every day, making it challenging for researchers to process and analyze it all. GATK is designed to handle large amounts of data efficiently, allowing researchers to work with genomic datasets that are tens of gigabytes in size. Another advantage of GATK is its robustness. GATK is based on the best practices developed by the Broad Institute, which have been rigorously tested and validated. This makes GATK a trusted tool for many researchers, who can rely on it to produce accurate and reliable results. GATK also provides a user-friendly interface, making it accessible to researchers with varying levels of computational expertise. The toolkit includes a set of command line tools that can be used to perform a wide range of genomic analyses, as well as a graphical user interface that makes it easy for users to navigate and visualize their results. Despite its strengths, GATK is not without its limitations. One challenge with GATK is that it requires a significant amount of computational resources, which can be a barrier for some researchers. Additionally, GATK is designed to work with high-coverage sequencing data, so it may not be suitable for low-coverage sequencing experiments. In conclusion, GATK is a powerful and widely used tool for analyzing high-throughput sequencing data. Its ability to handle large amounts of data, its robustness, and its user-friendly interface make it a valuable resource for researchers in the field of genomics. While it has its limitations, GATK remains an important tool for understanding the genomic basis of human diseases and for advancing the field of genomics as a whole. Thanks for watching this video. Remember to like and share our videos, and leave your comments below. We'd love to hear from you.